Hello, boys and girls. This is Aunt Fernita, and I have a wonderful story for you called New Friends. Today's memory verse is from Acts chapter four, verse thirty-two. It says they shared everything they had. The message for today's story is God's children share what they have. Do you like to have company come to dinner? A long time ago, some people were just learning about Jesus. Let's imagine how one little girl and her family shared with them. Do a good job now, little Deborah. Mama said with a smile. Company is coming to dinner again tonight. Deborah looked up. Who? She asked. I don't know yet. Mama answered with a twinkle in her eye. Mama sat down and pulled little Deborah onto her lap and kissed her rosy cheek. I will explain it to you, Mama said. The apostles are preaching the good news about Jesus all over our city. They are preaching with great power, and hundreds of people are learning about Jesus every day. Deborah nodded. She knew the apostles were telling everyone about Jesus. Well, many of the new believers are from far away, Mama said. They came to Jerusalem for the great feast. They heard the apostles and learned about Jesus, and now they want to stay for a while and learn even more about Him. But some are running out of money, and that's why we are helping them. We will share God's love with them by sharing our dinner. Deborah slid off Mama's lap. I better hurry and finish sweeping, she said. Mama mixed a batch of bread. She kneaded the dough and shaped it into loaves. She put the loaves into the oven, and the wonderful smell of baking bread soon filled the house. There was a knock on the door. Mama's friend scurried in. "I have extra lentils," she said. "I thought you might be able to use them," she said as she left. "That's a lot of lentils, Mama," little Deborah said. "You're right," Mama agreed. She picked up the big sack and weighed it in her hands. God is providing extra food, and this will make lots of soup. God must be bringing many people to dinner tonight," she said. "How is my beautiful family?" Papa's booming voice filled the house. He scooped up little Deborah and gave her a gigantic hug. He put an arm around Mama and hugged her too. "That soup sure smells good!" Papa exclaimed, peering into the big pot. "We're sharing our supper!" Deborah exclaimed. She twirled across the floor. "We're sharing God's love with the new believers." "I know," Papa said. I will get cleaned up, and then we will all go to the apostles. We will find hungry believers and bring them home and feed them. And while we eat, we'll talk about Jesus. Deborah said, "That's my favorite part." This podcast was brought to you by GraceLink dot net and Studio El Piso. For more children's resources, please visit GraceLink dot net.